to take off with this pettiness. Yeah, make a post, watch it take off like a rocket ship. Hey, check my comments. All of these people, they savages. Yeah, don't come in here talking big if you can't handle it. Nah, I'm on a mission. They in they feelings, they only hear shots ringing out. Taking their personal lead, that's what I'm talking about. Petty. First, American voters told Trump to leave the White House. Now Trump's Mar-a-Lago neighbors in Palm Beach, they're saying, we don't want you to live here either. They're trying to enforce a 1993 agreement letting Trump convert the estate into a private club on the condition that nobody lives there. There's a lot of distrust in this community about Donald Trump because he has sued the town of Palm Beach. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to the... Petty. Hey yo, I'm Gerard McCain. This is It's your man, Shady Dawns. Hey man, we we here. We we it's it's one just one more game. It's a lot of shit going on in the news, man. We, we Chef, we, what you talking about, man? We, what you talking about, man? You know, my you know we gotta talk about Trump, man. We gotta talk about what's going on with Trump, man. Petty What? <laughs> Poison? Poison? Yeah. Yeah, poison. You can't trust a big button to smile, man. Um, well, I, I, I'm supposed to be working on that. Uh, they kicked me out of Mar-a-Lago, so I, I couldn't get my work out in. Man, <laughs> how do you, how do you? <laughs> that was too good. How do, listen, man, how do you go from being the president to not being accepted into your own neighborhood that you purchased a long time ago and you've been going back and forth to this place for years. I would not trust going back to the neighborhood. They don't want him there. <laughs> they don't want him there. You know how bad it is when your neighbors ain't gonna look up for your crib? <laughs> Remember back in the day you had to tell the neighborhood thief like, yo, I'm leaving out of town for a little while. Just in case you come back and shit was robbed, yes. you could look at him. Right, right, right. Now right. they're like, nigga, we about to infiltrate your host. They hey. about to do some, uh, what's that stuff? The breaking in through the... Uh, What's the cryptocurrency? They're about uh, to find some kind of way to take the rest of his money because his empire is falling down. Yeah, it's falling apart, man. Not, not only did they not want him to come back to Mar-a-Lago, he's losing all kind of business contracts. You know what I'm saying? His, his, but he rich, though. I don't know. I don't know that man's pockets. He got hella loot. I don't know that man's pockets, but I know one thing, man. I know when, as a hospitality brand, in the United States, that shit is over with. It's a hundred percent over with. His peers, his constituents, his insurrectionist people—they not dealing with him no more, man. They, he he he's yeah, lost all yeah. of his contracts with the city of New York. I mean, like like really big contracts. Nah, when you can't go back to New York. Nah, he can't go back to New York. Damn, he, That's you, why he was trying to go to Florida, man. I don't know. My, my man Yang, he about to run for mayor, too. Yeah, they, they trying to run him up out of Florida. He might as well go back to Russia, man. Florida, yeah. he might, he, you know, craziness happens in Florida. Yeah, it does. A lot of craziness happens in Florida. And on top of that, you know, there's a lot of, see, the thing about it is they don't want nobody bringing a lot of, you know, heat to where they live at because this shit is secluded. I'm definitely bringing heat wherever I go. Proud boys, stand down and stand by. We may be going to Florida. <laughs> Petty. Do you know one of the Proud Boys is FBI? Yeah. Under, he's yeah. like undercover. He's yeah. finally a snitch. Yeah. yeah. See, so, as, as they, Trump. I mean, they everywhere, <sighs> man. Like, why, why do you think this country runs the way it runs? Like, th this, this, this ain't new. This is just, it's being putting it open more but this ain't new this is this has been going on for i don't know how long man it's 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 proud boys in the congress man the wall. it's proud boys and proud girls tell, in the you. congress i'm gonna tell you man why it's do you think down. congress runs the way it runs why do you like like all of a sudden now all of a sudden people want to change stuff and and now they want to help and no man they they been proud boys and proud girls in the congress ted cruz you know you number one yeah, I said your name. Petty. I ain't never seen you so passionate before, McCain. Because, man, you, like, I had to What do you got to invest into this, because man? Because I've lived this, you know what I'm saying? I, you lived that I, Trump life? I, no, not lived the Trump life. But Was I, you involved? I've lived this life as far as you not, trusted? Being, not, not, not getting what you deserve because of your skin color. Like, I've lived that life. You know what I'm saying? You light skin, man. Stop it, man. What, what that got to do with it? Hey. You know it's been 
It's what been that hard. Guy? My it's Uncle hard. Chico, they just took my Uncle Chico to jail, man. His Chico, name is Chico. Keep your head up, baby. His name is Chico. <laughs> keep your head up the bars. He represents Latino, man. See, he's still light skinned. Light skinned niggas gotta stick together, man. You making me think about that one guy who died. died. What's his name? Herman McCain? Herman McCain, yeah. Should, oh, Herman Cain. Herman Cain. Oh. Are you related? Nah. Oh. I'm a McCain. He's a Cain. Are we racist? I'm not. You sure? Yeah, I'm very sure. You're gonna put that to the test this year. No, I'm 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 I know for a fact I'm not racist. Well, you know you petty. But I know people have been racist towards me. I'm feeling there's something going on beneath all this whole conversation because you keep talking about me and being persecuted. I think you need that one chick no, that be helping people out. No, I don't need no help. I'm just What's her ex- name? I'm just expressing myself. You know what I'm saying? I'm not I'm not sitting here, you know, crying about I don't this have or crying that kind about of that. Degree. I'm just expressing myself because, you know, when you when you go through certain things in life and you 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 get excluded or you know you you get picked over because of your skin color not because of you know your your skill level but because of your skin color yeah that it tends to that's petty. It tends to, it's petty and it tends to stay with you for a while so yeah i'm how long it, has, it has it been? bothered me it's, how long has it been how long have i been black petty See, that's the kind of things I mean, I've always been black. You know what I'm saying? My nigga, I've always been black. I have black. I think rich black thoughts I was all born day black long. Too. I think rich black thoughts all day long. So when Trump come along, it don't phase me. He's about to be gone now. Second impeachment. I mean, lawyers, his his first group of lawyers abandoned him. Right. <laughs> that's what I wanted to talk about. <laughs> and then and then uh his neighbors don't fuck with him. His business is going down the tube. I mean, when you talk about say, on some some fucked up nigga shit, that motherfucker is, just, is taking the cake. But there's something else. Prince. <laughs> that Prince? Purple Rain. Okay. See, so you gotta understand, see, this nigga Trump, if he if he gets impeached or whatever. He he could make a second, not a second. He can make another party. He can get with the rest of the Republicans. He can make a new party, and then govern that party because he got a lot of Trump Cullingans, whatever they call. It. And then that's gonna make us look like, hmm, fuck y'all. Why y'all keep having all these parties, different political agendas? There's a master up there that's looking at us, like judging us, like not judging us, but looking at us, like, are y'all really gonna keep giving to this bull crap? I ain't that petty, dude. I'm petty. I ain't that petty. He gets nothing from me. Petty. It wasn't really about him. It, but the objective of it was is that your peers will be so petty towards you when you are not doing what they think you should be doing or what they want you to be doing or what you've been caught doing that you wasn't supposed to be doing. It's just funny how they now all of a sudden his peers are... And it's switched on him. It, 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 ain't, it ain't no more MAGA. <laughs> now it's <laughs> insurrectionist. That's some real petty shit, dog. But it, like, it is. That's, been, that's why we the petty show. All, that's why we talking about it. We've been going it. through it all our lives. I get a fuck, man. I get zero fucks. I ain't on it no more, man. This, this time around, looking at the whole situation like, yo, get me mine. Get me mine through crypto. Give me mine through uh, deals, contracts. Give me mine through legislation. Give me mine through uh, justice for my people. Give me, my, give me mine through uh, everything, education. You know, give me mine at the board. You know what I'm saying? Because right now, we got a curfew in Ohio um, from Mike DeWine. Give me mine. Let's, let's open up our own parties, man. Fuck these parties, man. The blues, the reds, all that shit be. I'm, I'm done with it. Fuck them. I, I, I'm sorry, petty people. You know what? And thank you, petty audience. I think y'all, grow, we growing. Man, you know we, we in like South America and uh, Central America and Africa. We, we, we grew over 2020, man. Thank y'all, man. You're giving shots out, man. Love y'all. Peace. It's going down like that, man. 
the lawyers, your, your legislators aren't fucking with you, dude. Why is that? I, if I, I can remember when I was going through my little legal battles. <clears throat> if my lawyers abandoned me, I, I just knew I was going to be upstate for years and years and years. I had to fire one of my lawyers. You, you got you to gotta fire them. They don't fire you, the client. Fuck out of here. <laughs> Fuck out of here, man. I can't, I can't, man. I can't. I think the reason why they, that they, they quit was because it was, a, it was a difference of opinion. They thought that they were, was going in there to argue one thing, but he wanted them to argue another thing. He told them that the case was so simple that <laughs> I could argue it myself. Like, come on, Trump. Like, chill out, man. You you don't know every goddamn thing, man. Let them lawyers do their job, man. How are you going to try to tell them First what to off, argue to, you he know wants to talk. They want to talk about the insurrection. That's the whole beef. But he wants to go back and talk about the election. He want to talk about him Fuck losing the, the election. election. Right. That's like, a done deal. Now you lose, you losing a whole party, your people. You, you're not even on trial for the election. You're on trial for, for the insurrection. Well, how, how can you tell them to argue that you lo- that the he said the election was stolen from him. Yeah, I would have left his ass too if I was his lawyer. So now your brand is messed up because now you look yeah. like a, 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 a simpleton. You, you petty. So now you're pet, you petty, you petty to the whole world. Now your your business friends, your banking friends, your real estate friends, they're looking just like you know what. Fuck out here, nigga. I can't. I can't. They didn't already cut him off. I'm lo- I'm losing money. Just like just like uh, just like the uh, people on Wall Street on Reddit this this past week. Can you believe niggas on social media, nerds, jackoff boys, done destroyed Wall Street? Gonna crept in through some Reddit type stuff. Is that is that what they were talking about with the GameStop thing? Yes, yes. What they did was they just. All they did was so simple. Bought little little petty stocks from uh, GameStop abundantly. Abundantly. Like, like what are you doing with the Petty Podcast Show? All we're doing is putting out content on a repeated basis. People are catching on to it. Now it's going to this city, this state, this country, this continent. And now we're coming together and saying, fuck y'all big boys. You're out of here. That's the whole thing about the um, the Reddit and the GameStop. It's a stop to y'all's game. Fuck out of here. And the, and, the, and the neighborhood? Man, when you can't go back to the neighborhood, man, you suspect. You suspect, Speaking of going G. back to the neighborhood, Trump, you can't go back to Mar-a-Lago. I don't know what you're going to do. Hey, man. But I'll so be there. Good. I'll be there. Watch, I'll be there in Mar-a-Lago. Chilling with my nuts hanging out with a pina colada. Fuck out of here. Petty. Petty. Nah, I'm on a mission. They in their feelings. They only hear shots ringing out. Taking their personal lead. That's what I'm talking about. Petty. Cool, I'm a fan. Feel like the man with this petty shirt I got. Swag crush out the box. Just to compliment my top. They hating, no worry, I got them. I know what it's like from the bottom. That's why I came up, but this money, it just keep on coming.